So your last ninja challenge is actually going to be very easy. All you have to do is answer these questions in a Microsoft Word document and upload it to Schoology. But it has to be double spaced. Okay? So instead of having to retype all these questions, we can just copy and paste them from the Schoology website. So let's go ahead and log into Schoology. Okay, so once you're in, you'll see this assignment here, the power of words. You go ahead and click on that, and you can just select that question. Oops, make sure you get what you want selected in blue. Then you hit Control C for copy. Then in your new Microsoft Word document, you can paste it. So you don't have to retype it. But what I want you guys to do is make sure that in the right upper right hand corner you write your first name and, and your last name you write the date which is today would be December 4th and the class which is Tech 5 I want you to center your title and call it the power of words and you can bold and underline it whatever you want so you can hit control B or control U and um, that'll be it and then, oops, excuse me, and then um, to double space it, when you're finished or you can just start off, you can select everything and go to this part of the screen right here where it says line spacing and hit 2.0 because we're double spacing. Okay, and once you're done with that, once you've finished all the questions, so um, once you've finished typing up the answer to this, you're going to go back to Schoology and you're going to copy and paste this question, number two. And you're going to copy and paste that one too. You're going to try and make it all look aligned and organized, okay? It kind of takes a while, but you can do it. Okay? Um, and then you're going to answer it. Once you're done, you're going to save it. So you go to Save As and you can save it in your documents for now. You can save it as power of, power of words and your name. Um, I'm going to save it to Sandbox in our Tech 5 folder. I'm just going to save that. No, oh, it's not letting me. I'm just going to save it to my documents then. If it doesn't let you, just save it to your documents. Save it somewhere, you'll remember. Once you're finished, you're going to go back to Schoology and you're going to upload it. There will be a drop box over here where it's going to say Submit Assignment and that's where you're going to do it. Okay, good luck.